With so many tasks on our to do list, it's easy to feel like we're connected to our phones 24 7. Yeah, and yeah. even the kids, too, they're constantly on their devices. It's also easy to let those screen habits slide right into dinner time. So, when we should be talking about our day, are we swiping and liking instead yes. and distracted? Yeah, Dr. Debbie Goboa is here to get us back on track. And you say it can all be fixed with a simple little conversation starter, right? Right. So, there's an entrepreneur and mom here in Pittsburgh named Alana Schwartz. And she, even when her son was really little, she would say, how was your day? And she would want stories and he would give one word answers. Uh -huh. And she and her husband would try and draw him out and they weren't really getting anywhere. And they realized for him, it wasn't that fun. So she created this game. And first of all, it's a spinner. And honestly, the spinner's the best part of every who board game that has a spinner, spinner right? Like yeah. who doesn't like a spinner? <laughs> but it's really fun because whatever it lands on and the parents have to play too, yeah. it gets your kid talking in stories. And when we hear their stories, not only do we feel more connected and get more connected to them, but they learn. They learn about different emotions. They learn about problem solving. They learn how to tell their own stories, which is lifelong valuable. The skills that this teaches turn out to protect kids from some of the mental health struggles that we've talked about mm -hmm. people having, right? That difficulty. Well, and on here too, this is really self-explanatory. I remember when this was first launched with Eat Park, we, we spoke yeah. about this and on the back it kind of labels what everything is the compliment the kind kindness highlight the low light of your day and like you mentioned we we took this home and we played this with our kids and they loved just spinning it and even finding that little low light i wanted pizza for lunch and i got chicken nuggets instead that was a real bummer today mm -hmm. it doesn't seem like much but you're getting them to open up about something that wasn't good that they got through and they're okay now. And then when you ask them about like a kindness, what's a kindness you did for someone or did they did for you, you hear stories you wouldn't have heard if right. you just said, what happened today or how was your day? At this time, I think kids need to feel seen and heard and supported more than ever. And Family Spinner helps you do that without it feeling forced or fake at all. Mm -hmm. Yeah, And I can see how this could really be important because when you're staring at your phone all the time, especially kids, I mean, you really don't have the opportunity to express yourselves. And that's probably where those one word answers yeah. came from because you're not talking to a real person. Right. And it's a genuine <laughs> answer. You're like, nothing much. Here, wait, okay, will you play with me? Yeah, yeah I will. Right. Try it. All right, so mine says highlight. Do you have a highlight for today? Honestly, my, hi my highlight today, well, I've been up for enough hours, so I think have it's a highlight today. today. Right. <laughs> uh, my highlight today was FaceTiming with my family. I was able to, and I know that that involves a device, but I was able yeah. to check in with them this morning and that see is... them happy and smiling and laughing. That's really awesome. Yeah, Good answer, Heather, okay. Good spin there. Oh, highlight, another awesome. highlight. Nice. The highlight was because it was really cold here in the studio this morning. It's rather cold now, but I remembered to bring my jacket this morning. <laughs> so I was sitting at my desk like, yes, all cozy because and warm. yesterday I didn't have it and I was really chilly and I felt bad for Heather because she doesn't have my hands are still on. cold. My yes. <laughs> so, so let's talk about where you can find these because this right. is great. I, there's this edition now, but you also have this one that you can find at Eaton Park. So we are partnered with Eaton Park and Eaton Park you know, they're all about smiles, right? Mm -hmm. Like smiley cookies, you can go to you can go to the Pirates game and spin the wheel and get things. This is something you can win. But also, if you go into an Eaton Park or do takeout from an Eaton Park right now, while supplies last, look at me, learning the lingo, <laughs> um, you'll get one for free. You That's can, awesome. They'll, they're targeting families with kids, but anybody can ask for one. If you just happen to be going in to get something for yourself or your parent and you want to grab one to have at home, and you get to keep it and have it, and it's got the smiley dude all over it, smiley cookie all over it, which is really fun. That's cool, and I'm sure you've really seen something as simple as this little game change an entire family dynamic. We were lucky enough to do a study with the Jewish Healthcare Foundation here in Pittsburgh and put these into the hands of 500 families of preschool through eighth grade. And what we found in the pre and post testing is that the kids were better at sitting longer at a meal and paying attention and engaging. They were, became better problem solvers and they and their parents felt like they knew each other better afterwards. It's amazing. Wow. And quickly, uh, Ronald McDonald House. Right, we're partnering with Ronald McDonald House and we're working to get these spinners into the hands of sick kids and the families who are supporting them so that kids have language to talk to their doctors and their psychologists and their teachers and their parents about what they're going through. And a, and a nice way to bring that conversation about other things other than what Had they're going through. Had some fun. Yeah, yeah. Yes. I love this is for kids and yeah. adults too. Awesome. Like play every night. Thank you, Dr. G. <laughs> Thank you. Dr. G is a PTO regular and can be seen each month. For more information on the Family Spinner, you can go to PittsburghTodayLive.com and we will have a link for you there.